There's been an alarming amount of fires in the last few weeks. In Vanceboro yesterday, crews from nine different area departments worked to get a fire under control. Our Claire Molay talked to officials today to learn more about the damage and if the incident is still posing a threat today. Here just off of Bay Bush Road in Vanceboro is where a 150 acre woods fire broke out yesterday afternoon. And although the fire is now contained, crews are still out here today monitoring its conditions. Craven County's Fire Marshal Stanley Kite says he cannot yet confirm the cause, but the Forest Service says it was likely caused by someone burning debris. Craven County Ranger Greg Riggs says crews are still out making sure the fire does not start up again. As of uh, about 4.30, 5 o'clock yesterday, it was contained. And now we're just mopping up today, just trying to keep everything inside the lines. Kite says as farmers are getting ready for spring, it's a popular time to burn vegetation. But it can be dangerous. The intensity of the wind yesterday made yesterday's events much stronger, much bigger. Um, it just helped fuel the, fast, the rate that it was spreading and the, the amount of fuel that it was burning. Crews managed to keep the fire from burning any structures and there were no injuries in the incident. We had both fire engines as well as brush trucks and the North Carolina Forest Service had airplanes and helicopters, and, uh, heavy equipment. Uh, some local farmers volunteered and pitched in with their equipment. Kite says the most important thing here is if you do choose to burn, absolutely do not leave it unattended even for a couple seconds. And he says if it's a windy day, please find another time to burn. Reporting in Vanceboro, Claire Mollet, 9 on your side.